I um, spent the day studying. And now it's raining, so it's a day of suffering for all. This is a place where I don't feel alone. This is a place where I feel at So this is probably the final update I'll be giving from Paris. Not that I vlogged that much this semester, but this is my room. It's pretty bare now. Those are my suitcases. And this is my bed. And my entire room was garden themed, which is very cute. Um, so it's Thursday, May 30th right now. And my flight is in about 16-ish hours and I'll be flying straight to San Francisco from the Orly Airport. Um, it's really crazy giving this update after this entire semester. I came in here with not really any expectations but I was just really freaking afraid all the time and now I'm leaving having learned so much, having met such cool people, having done so many cool things here and I've traveled a lot but I've also gotten to know Paris so much and when I first got here I didn't know that it was possible for me to like a city but I learned that you kind of get used to things really quickly and 
once I got used to the city noises and all that, I really, really came to love Paris. It is my favorite European city. City, everything it has everything you want. Even though there's so much history and culture, it's always changing. And honestly, if I could redo my study abroad experience, I would not change anything. I think Paris was the absolute best, and it was such a great semester. It's really gonna suck going back to Cornell after this, but. You know, that's, that's life, and yeah, I've just been kind of sad all day, but I guess here's just my short update. Paris, I want to see you a lot. Tu vas me manquer beaucoup, and I'm so glad my French has gotten better, even if that sounded like trash. Anyway, peace out for the last time in Paris. Bye.